If you're new, welcome. My name is Jess and if you're not new, then thank you for returning. So today's video is very exciting because I'm going to be showing you guys one of my favorite beauty tricks to do and that is brow lamination. So I have been laminating my eyebrows since November, December of last year and it has truly elevated the look of my eyebrows. I love it because your eyebrows just look styled automatically. You don't have to do the soap brows, you don't have to do the gel, you don't have to use products, you, don't, you literally don't have to put anything in your eyebrows. You just comb them up and they look beautiful instantly. I really love the look of a fluffy eyebrow and I even make jokes sometimes because when I do freshly laminate my eyebrows it looks like I've gone through a wind tunnel. Like my eyebrows are just sticking up. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how I do my brow lamination. I know you can get this professionally done. I do mine at home. The kit that I use you can actually get off of Amazon and this is what it looks like. I will link it down below. It's super easy to do. It does take a little while because you need to wait for all of the solutions to do their work but it's totally worth it. I do this about every four to six weeks. Sometimes I go a little longer, but I can definitely tell when it's time to laminate my eyebrows. Right now, it's been about, I wanna say five, maybe six weeks, and my eyebrows just won't brush up anymore, so I know it's time to laminate them. I would definitely start with a clean and groomed set of eyebrows, or else it's gonna be a little harder. You can also just groom your eyebrows yourself, but I like to get my eyebrows done professionally. Okay, so for this, I'm actually going to tie my hair back. Also, I have no makeup on from my eyebrows up, so. We're good. Okay, so the kit comes with basically everything you're going to need. So you just follow the instructions. I think the hardest part really is gluing your eyebrows down. You do have to glue your eyebrows in the exact direction that you want them laminated, basically. So if your eyebrows are glued down and you've brushed them all this way, that's how they're going to laminate. So I like to brush my eyebrows up. I do have a clean spoolie here for me to use. But you just brush your eyebrows up. I do like to glue them down one eyebrow at a time. In fact, I do chunks of my eyebrow because this glue does work very, very fast. So, so to start, I am brushing my eyebrows in an upward direction. And now I'm taking the glue from the kit and I am brushing that through small sections of my eyebrows. This glue does dry really fast, so you want to make sure to take your time and really comb through each eyebrow. And then as you can see here, I'm brushing up and pressing the eyebrows down into my skin so they're glued down. And in my opinion, this part does take the longest. It's really important for you to comb through your brows and make sure that the eyebrows are separated and in the exact direction that you would want them to be brushed in. Here I'm just doing a final brush through making sure the hairs are all in place and I'm finally done with my first eyebrow. And here I'm showing you the difference between the eyebrow I haven't glued down and the eyebrow that is glued down already. So this almost shows like a before and after of brow lamination. I love how fluffy and thick my eyebrow looks compared to the one that hasn't been glued down. And here I'm repeating the same process on the other eyebrow, gluing it down in small sections and combing up. Okay, so it is finally time to apply our first solution and I apply it with a Q-tip. As you can see, I just coat my eyebrows with the perming solution. And I repeat on the second eyebrow as well, making sure that my eyebrows are fully saturated. Okay, so I'm basically done with the first perm solution and now I have to stick this plastic wrap over my eyebrows and let it sit for 10 minutes. So that's what I'm going to do. All 
All right, so you're gonna look like this for 10 minutes. And let me set my timer and then I will be back to do the next step. Okay, so the 10 minutes are up and I'm removing the plastic wrap. I'm also taking a Q-tip and I'm just removing the first solution that we applied. And then you want to brush your eyebrows up, making sure that they're still in the position that you want them to lay. And now we're going to move on to solution number two. And we're going to repeat the same process we used for solution number one. You're going to use a Q-tip and coat your eyebrows with the solution, making sure they are fully saturated. Cover your eyebrows once again with the plastic wrap and leave on for 10 minutes. Remove the plastic wrap after 10 minutes and then you're going to remove all of the solution. At this point I like to use a paper towel since it's a lot easier to get everything off. To moisturize my eyebrows a little bit, I apply some evening primrose oil. You can use any facial oil that you have. I have this on hand, so this is what I'm using on my eyebrows. And then I like to brush the oil through and basically see the outcome of all of my hard work. And after I've brushed them into place, this is the final result. They look a lot thicker and fluffier than they were before. It's also a lot easier for me to brush them into place and for the hairs to actually stay where I want them to stay. Alright guys, so that's basically how I laminate my eyebrows. As you can see, they are a lot easier to comb into place. I haven't put any product in them. I did apply a little bit of oil just to moisturize my brow hairs, but other than that, they stay up in place by themselves basically. So this is how they look. I love the big, bold, bushy brows. I do have a good brow and I do have a not so good brow. So. This eyebrow would definitely need some makeup and some filling in, but other than that, I don't really need to do much to my eyebrows after this. I highly recommend you laminate your eyebrows. If you're looking for something a little bit more bold and you're sick and tired of filling in your eyebrows super extreme just to get a big fluffy brow, this is definitely something to try out. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this brow tutorial, and if you did, don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will see you in my next video. Oh, 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 o